Whoa. 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 Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. Thank you so much for tuning in. I hope you're all having a great day so far. Today we are going to be doing part 3 of the Can I Recreate Clint Boyer's 2014 Daytona Flip from the Budweiser Duels. We are just about ready to get going green. I have already arranged this qualifying order for those of you who haven't seen the replay of this wreck in a while. I'll give you a little refresher. Denny was in first at the time of the wreck. I believe Kurt Busch was second. Gordon was third. Johnson was dropping back. He then gets together with Jamie McMurray. They both go spinning. Clint Boyer turns down into David Reagan to avoid the wreck. And in the process, Clint Boyer does his airborne 360. Comes back down on all fours. So unfortunately, we're not going to be able to really be able to get Johnson to wreck on command. At the very least, we can try turning down on 34. Come on. Well, at least we flipped our first attempt. Wasn't a clean landing, but at least we flipped. Okay, we're under caution. Stay behind the 34 car. So coming out of turn four, yeah, I'm still thinking of how I'm going to make it look like Johnson and McMurray are wrecking before I intentionally turn down and do my attempted flip. All right, so we've got Jimmy right next to me. I'm going to see if I can't wreck him or another Chevy. Nope. Oh, he kind of... Wrecked about in the same spot, but not the right way. I got spun, never got airborne. I don't think that one's even worth a replay. So the key is I want to try to spin either Jimmy or at least another Chevy so I can swap the paint schemes. Coming out of turn four without initially spinning myself. Looks like it's going to be Colmenard right here. Shoot, except that's, that's the definition of initially spinning myself. Nice save, but busted the reenactment. Oh no, we wrecked prematurely on the start of this one. Yeah, I got too good of a push on Jimmy. He went up into the wall, came down, and then I, I got the worst of it. So, Jamie, if you could go up there and just wreck Jimmy Johnson, that would be great. Oh, no! And we are upside down. And flipping. Tumbling. Twice over. Back on our wheels, but our engine is dead. Okay, we're under caution. Yeah, that was my bad. I just wasn't in a good spot in the pack. I nailed David Reagan, go back, Kyle Larson hits me and sends me upside down as I'm going back towards the outside wall. I tumble over once, back down on all fours. The way and spot I flipped kind of looked like Casey Atwood. I kind of messed the start of this one up, I'm just trying to get past the 34. I'm able to do... Jimmy is not wrecking with McMurray, obviously, but come on. Uh-oh, that's going to be big. Jeez. He's yelling out pit instructions as I'm tumbling through the infield. <laughs> obviously, Jimmy and Jamie didn't wreck to start this all off, but... The start of that looked promising, except instead of going back on all fours, I landed on my roof slid until I hit the grass and dug in and went for a wild ride. Next! I just have no idea how I'm going to get anything remotely close to a wreck up front to make it look like my spin back here gets naturally triggered instead of just turning down on the 34. Which, oh no, oh no. That's going to be bad. 
Actually, it wasn't what he was about. I thought it was going to be. Oh no! From how that was starting to look, that looked like it could have been way worse. I got stuck to the 34 at first. We were heading towards the inside wall. I got unstuck, but then I decided to turn back left. That wasn't really too big of a wreck there. That was a pretty big hit, but. Next! With that save game editor, I kept putting Jimmy down to the bottom, or the outside line, but he keeps getting to the bottom. Oh no, I tried to block Carl, and we're wrecking early. Alright, we are not even in a clear spot. Oh, we gotta clear into the 34. Whoa. 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 In second, the yellow flag is out. Let's go. Race Keep it off the wall. wall. Okay. Oh, oh what a save. Okay, you're clear of pit lane. Two wheeled save in it. Possibly the greatest save of the year. I turn down into David Reagan. Go lifting up through the air. He sends me just on my driver's side on two wheels. That's a little bit of scraped up left side, but it's all just body work. Turn down left. Almost hit the wall, but don't. Wow. Gotta hope Jamie can get up there and wreck Jimmy, but... Oh no, alright, here we go. Come on, come on! Nope. Spun out in about just the right spot, but... Not a clean landing. No! Darn it! Reckon before we even got to turn one. A decent lead up. Come on. Oh, darn it. We got Johnson wrecked and we were able to get the 34 to be the one to spin us. We got up in the air, but didn't get all the way over. So when I saw we had Johnson on the outside and Reagan on the inside, I knew it was going to be. A good opportunity, but I didn't get the spin quite the way I wanted to. He came down on top of Johnson. Next! Shoot! Ouch! I tried pushing Johnson up the track, he came down hit me, and then I got hit by the 21 and hard into that inside wall. Wasn't able to get Johnson. I can maybe wreck Menard. He's a Chevy as well. Darn it. And of course, Michael hits me. Of course, Michael has to come plowing in and send me tumbling. I was seeing if I could drift up and hit Paul Menard. Have him be the replacement for Jimmy. Then I go airborne, up back across the track, and then Michael Aldrip hits me at the very last second and sends me tumbling. Oh, come on, Jimmy. What are you doing, Jimmy? The yellow flag is out. Let's go. Race back to the line. Well, now. So like I've done in most of these starts, I kind of pushed Jimmy aside so I could get underneath him, but he pushed me back, and then admittedly at that point I just was gassing it to see what would happen. Pretty spectacular results. Next! Alright, so Jimmy kind of escaped and got too far out front. We got Paul Menard right alongside of us. Luckily all these cars that were running up front are all Chevys for the most part, so we can switch most of the paint schemes around. Alright, let's throw him into the wall. Come on. Come on. Land it. Oh, darn it. Back on my wheels. About five seconds too late. So I was able to bump Paul Menard. If that were Jimmy, I can switch and that could have, uh, he could have taken the place of Jimmy right there, switching the paint schemes. Got airborne and upside down, but I didn't land it. Next. No, darn it. Once again, I took out Jimmy prematurely. Alright, not 
not even gonna replay that one. I gotta say though, I do really love the white Jimmy Johnson paint scheme. Alright, we don't have a Ford behind us to spin us, but we're still gonna smash Jimmy into the wall right here. And Kyle Larson send us on us on our side. We are gonna spin back across the track and save it, but eh, that one's not even worth a replay either. This one is not gonna be too good either. Come on. Whoa! Trevor Bain is barely snuck by underneath my car. Yeah, watch the 21 through all this. He goes flying down. He goes right underneath me. Hard hits for both the 78 and the 34. side right here. Uh-oh, that's not going to be good. Bam! Hard into that inside wall. Ouch. Yeah, I'm trying to hit Jimmy up in the outside line to make it look like he's wrecking, but I keep spinning the wrong way and hard into that inside wall. And here we go. We got Jimmy in the high line. Hit him. Darn it. No! Keep spinning too early. That one's not even worth a replay either. Come on, Jimmy. Jimmy Rex. Come on. Nope. Ouch. We flipped in about the same spot, but holy crap. That was definitely not a gentle landing. Alright, we tried hitting... Jimmy sent him wrecking. We tried turning down to wreck ourselves with upside down into that inside wall hard. And we land back right side up after hitting the safer barrier. Okay, we got Jimmy up on the high side. We just need to wreck him correctly and then wreck ourselves correctly. Wreck ourselves, come on. Oh, darn it. That was not a gentle landing. That was flat down on the roof. I'm sorry, the roof. So we tried taking out Jimmy first. We didn't quite get him, and then we spin, fly, and just slam down Pancake right on the top of the car. Right, come on, Jimmy. Let's do this. Oh, darn it. We could have had someone hit us while we were getting airborne. That might have been better. We did take out Jimmy, so that was successful, but unfortunately we didn't get upside down. We didn't flip. We did get airborne, but not quite enough. Next! All right, so we got Jimmy up top. Send you into the wall. And now, come on, flip all the way up and over. Oh, no. Did a double barrel roll. I tried hitting the brakes when I went airborne. That time, I think it was a little too late. Decent good hit for Jimmy to try to get him involved in the wreck, and then I turned down. Yeah, next time I'll try hitting the brakes a little earlier when I uh, get airborne. Next! Come on, Jimmy. Oh no, oh no. We got spun the wrong way. Almost went into the catch fence. So we get turned the wrong way by Johnson, go airborne along the outside wall. Next! Come on, Jimmy. Come on, Jimmy. Oh no! Oh no, that is a hard, hard hit. I hit Jimmy all right, and I went back down to get turned towards the inside, and I get hit Eric McClure style into that inside wall. All right, come on, come on. Oh, 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 we're going almost in the inside wall. I thought we were going to hit it at first, but yep, there we go. I thought we were going to hit that inside wall way harder than we did. 
Yeah, right around here, it was looking like it was going to be Randy LaJoy 1984 all over again, but settled back down and just barely hit the inside wall. Next! Right, so far, so good. Let's hit Jimmy up on the outside wall. Come on. Come on, Timmy Hill, send me upside down. Darn it. I'm not getting too much luck getting Jimmy to wreck. And even when I do, I can't flip the right way. I haven't flipped the right way, period, let alone getting the other cars to wreck first. Alright, we don't have Jimmy alongside of us, so we're going to have to pretend the 33 is Jimmy. Alright, get into the wall. Come on. Come on. Oh, darn it. I still got a lot of cars. I'm lucky I got clipped. That sent me flipping in the first place. Yeah, I was able to hit the 33. He started to pile up behind me, and it's only because I got clipped by the one car, Jamie Mack. And I actually got sent sideways and airborne. Please cooperate. I need Jimmy to start a wreck after I hit him, and I need to get hit the right way. That'll send me flipping the right way. Come on. Oh! Can we count that? I gotta drive to my pit stall in case we can count that. I made sure to hit the brakes the moment I got airborne. That actually kind of seemed to work a little bit. You've exploded a tire. Okay, we're under caution. Catch up to the end of the pacing line. The pace cars on the back straight. Stay behind the 42 car. Alright, so coming out of turn four, I hit Johnson. He actually started a small wreck. And I go up in the air. I. Oh, that was so close. So close. I'm going to save that. But oh, I don't know if that's quite close enough. I actually made an made an effort to drive to my pits in case this ends up being the one, like Clint did. All right, everyone, I am out of time. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please hit the like button if you did. I did go ahead and save this last attempt for a thumbnail, maybe at the very least. So again, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. Uh, if you are interested in any one of the following links, uh, they are all down below in my. Uh, description i'm on twitch facebook and twitter and last but not leastly if you would like to be kind enough as to help support this channel while getting cool little rewards in return for doing so please uh go check out my patreon page also down in the description thanks so much to adria fitzy jay barker and drive through for your support on patreon i truly appreciate you three thank you so much and that is it. I will see you all later. I hope you all have a good rest of your day, and I hope to see you all next time. Peace.